Hi, I'm organizing expert Mary Carla Magno, and I wanted to share some of my best tips to maintain a healthy balance in your life. It's not about having it all and doing it all. It's really about finding the right tips and tools to support your healthy lifestyle. So I have some of my favorite tips and tools to share with you today. The first tip is simple. Write it down. Studies show that you're 42% more likely to accomplish your goals and achieve your task by simply writing it down, which is why I love the posted super sticky notes. They stick and re-stick. They come in a broad range of colors and varieties, and you can get them in lined pages. But what I love about them is that they're like organization to go. You can take them from your wall calendar to your daily planner. If you're reviewing important documents and need to mark your spot, I love the post-it flags and tabs, or even marking your spot in a recipe and, and a cookbook. Definitely check them out on postit.com for all of the varieties, and I know you'll find something to suit your style. They also have a great quiz which shows you what your planner type is, so check that out also. Now, when you're cleaning your house, I always look for multi-purpose tools. You don't want to spend a lot of time doing it, so when you can cut your time in half, that is a great solution to saving time. Clorox Sentiva wipes do just that. They're a three-in-one, a triple threat. They smell great, they clean, and they disinfect. They have destination-inspired scents now of Hawaiian sunshine and my personal favorite, which is Tuscan lavender and jasmine. They really elevate the cleaning experience. Um, and they kill 99.9% um, of bacteria and viruses. So check them out on Clorox.com as well. My final tip is all about you. We're really trying to maintain a healthy balance. I always try to get up and be the first person in my house when it's quiet, and I can really take some time to reflect on the day ahead. If it's just to simply meditate or have a cup of coffee by myself or to review your to-do list, it's a great time to get centered. I also have a homework assignment for you. For a couple of days, don't do a to-do list, do a what I have done list. When you write down how long it takes for you to achieve a goal, you're much more likely to achieve it. So that's just a great tip to take with you. If you want more information about the tips I covered today, check out postit.com, clorox.com, and you can check out my book, Live More, Want Less, which is available on amazon.com and bn.com.